<laughs> Anthony, let's do it. Let's talk about how did the whole thing with The Voice happen? Wait, yeah. First explain, what is the show, The Voice? The Voice is a uh, t uh, singing competition show uh, okay. NBC, on NBC. Um, I grew up watching the show, actually, with my mom. You know, with you know, with the show is really cool because there's lots of different kinds of artists from country to pop to R and B. So, um, but how I got involved was just wait, real, wait, real fast. So, like, yeah. the voice, like the whole premise of it is like you have these like four judges and their backs are turned, right? Yeah. So there's four judges this year. The, I mean, the year with, that I was on, Adam Levine, Kelly Clarkson, Blake Shelton, and Jennifer Hudson. And you got to meet um, all of them. Yeah, that yeah. That's awesome. And um, so they like they listen to you sing, perform, and then if they like you, they press their button and turn around. That's right. So that's the first round. The first round is called the blind auditions. And okay. That's when the coaches aren't facing you, and then if they uh, turn around, at least one of them turns around, then you're on the show. Okay. Yeah. And so. Um, so who turned around for you? Adam Levine turned around for me. So nice. I'm on Team Adam. Yeah. Um, but first, how I got involved oh, yeah. in the show was just kind of random. They have a lot of different outlets that they recruit artists for um, and I happen to be I put up a video on Instagram and they they saw that we were talking about <laughs> the, the effects of the Instagram yeah. and musicians is becoming more and more relevant Wait, you put a video on Instagram like kind of like auditioning for the voice or are they just yeah so they it? have a hashtag that they put out and say put this you know hashtag oh, voice okay. casting and then um, they saw me through that and, they, and that's how I got involved and Ended up spending the summer in L.A. Really? It was like a whole summer was, almost. Yeah, it was crazy. It was a lot of fun. You um, had stayed in a hotel or something? Yeah, yeah. Um, and got to meet a lot of really great, you know, amazing contestants that uh, they're all musicians, obviously. And so it was fun to be in that atmosphere of like just music 24-7. And a special one that we'll talk about soon. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, that's right. That's but, right. But um, so, so how is like the... The experience of, like, say, working with Adam um, or any of the judges, do you actually spend a decent amount of time with them? Yeah, or is it just it was, like once a week, you like they check in with you. It was really cool. I mean, I so the, after the blind auditions, they go into the battles and the knockouts. Okay. I, I, that's the rounds that I um, was in, and okay. yeah, so like, you get to sit down with it. Adam. Brought in CeeLo Green. Oh, which really? It's like insane. I mean, because he used to be on The Voice. That, right? right. He was. I think he was the first season. He was one of the coaches. What was his um, song? Oh, crazy. crazy, yeah, yeah no, yeah. probably, yeah. He did forget you too. Yeah. Oh, cool. Um, so, uh, yeah, so I was a big fan of that. That was amazing yeah. being able to, you know, be in a room with them. And uh, and to the battle rounds is when you go against another person on Team Adam. Okay. And uh, and we sang Amy by Pure Prairie League. Okay, cool. And yes, yeah, so it was a lot of fun. I mean, playing on that voice stage is just so, it's so amazing. And Do you get to pick your songs, kind of, or like is the, they give they give you a certain selection of <laughs> songs to pick from? Yeah, I mean, you, um, yeah, I got to shoot, I played Danny song, and that was like one of my favorite folk tunes for my blind audition. And you like released that song later on. That's right, yeah. So, yeah. yeah. so got Emily was also on The Voice as well, right? Yeah, no, Emily um, was on Team Adam with me. We met over the summer. Oh, you were on the same yeah. team? That's right, yeah. Oh, wow, so you're on the same team. Yeah. You met, and you spent all time together. That's right, yeah, and we started dating. Um, and we're still dating now. She came out just last a uh, couple of weeks ago, and we did a show at Michael's on Main. You've done a couple of shows with her up here, right? That's right. Yeah, we did one back in December. Um, then we did another one just just recently, and uh, she's coming back. And for the end of July, we're doing another show at Michael's on Main. Um, they've been so much fun. We've been doing a lot of covers, um, arrangements, and then uh, our own originals and tunes that have kind of just been uh, stuck with us throughout our process, or throughout our career. So, is she from LA? She is from Illinois. Oh, and so she lives in Illinois. Yeah, it's a small town outside of Springfield, Illinois. Um, but we uh, we we're all down there in LA for the, yeah. for the filming of the show. So. So it's a long distance relationship. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Not easy. No, no, it's not. But it's not. It's been really great to share the you know share music with her and and be able to do shows together out here in California. And maybe sometime we can do a tour. I don't know. That but, is such a cool experience. Like you yeah. mentioned earlier, it's like, you know, what if like eventually, you know, you had married, you got married, you had kids, and all <laughs> of like, look what we met on The Voice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Does The Voice ever like do anything to like highlight that at all? Uh, well, they, they have had, I think, a couple before that uh, in the previous seasons. They didn't. Um, in an interview, they asked one time. Uh, it was funny. I don't know if it aired, but I was okay. doing my um, knockout song. I did The Operator by Jim Croce. It's a song about missing somebody, right? Oh, yeah. And 
they asked who was this about or who am I singing to. And I don't know if they accidentally or they, they kind of, they already knew about it, but that's, that's when funny. I told them, yeah. yeah. Um.